It is 6.40 a.m. We have been up since 6 a.m. watching the fishy. Hashtag mom life. Hey guys, Do It On A Dime family here. So one of my favorite ways to learn on a budget is getting thrifted books. I found this wild animals book at the Goodwill. It was $1.39. We've been talking a lot about animals and their habitats. And Carson is also getting his big boy room. So I wanted to get him a fish for his room so we could learn about the habitat, take care of a fish properly, have a little bit of responsibility for his age, but also do it on a budget. And I wasn't planning on sharing this in a video, but he woke me up at six o'clock this morning to talk about about the fish and he was the one who wanted to vlog about it. So the footage is a little bit dark, but you guys can see how we created the habitat and we also explained how we did it on a budget. So if you're looking to just have a really enriching experience for your kids, this is one of the ways that we do things like that. And I would love to hear about your pets too, or if your kids have any or sort of how you learn about caring for animals. Do you want to tell YouTube of some about Bluefishy's habitat? So let's talk about how people could do this on a budget. Where's the cheapest place to get plants? At the store. But it's really important that the plants are what kind of plants? Because we have a betta fish. Yeah, so they have to be sealed. They do have to be silk plants. But it's like old. To protect their fins, right? Because if they have plastic plants, it could scratch their fins. See Bluefish's fins. But where's the cheapest place to buy a tank? Craigslist. That's right. Craigslist is a great spot to buy tanks. They constantly, constantly have them. So you could really have an adventure of this undertaking fish? for under twenty dollars plus the cost of a fish. And, and maybe buy the wax. Also at the pet store. But guess where else you could get them? Yep, Dollar Tree sells them too. And we we did get our betta at the pet store. My brother came in this. He did come in that, didn't he? And you were very careful holding it at the pet store, weren't you? Is this a habitat for a betta? No. No, that's not a good habitat, is it? It's too small. What do bettas like to eat the most? Pellets and bread rolls. This is on Amazon. Yeah, it's way cheaper than the pet store, huh, to buy this online. These things are literally like $2 on Amazon, no lie, they're so cheap. How often should a betta fish eat? Breakfast and dinner. Can you do like this? That's right, let's show them how you do it. Let's tell YouTube, how many pellets should you feed the fishy? Feed. She is so hungry. She is so hungry. <gasps> he ate it. This is really important. If you get a betta, you have to get this. What is this? Bodo for the fishy. Yeah, we put it in the water and it helps cleanse the water so it's good for their, their fins, right? And where's that from? Amazon. Yep, way cheaper, huh? Are you listening to the filter? And the fish is giving you a kiss. <laughs> I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to leave your comments down below. Let me know what you want to see on this channel because this is my fun channel where we kind of just have a free-for-all. And I will catch you guys soon. Bye. Send for love. Dollar tree. Oh. Dollar tree toe. All right. You're going to show them what we hauling? <laughs>